your news channel is launching Be Mindful this week, an effort to support and highlight mental health efforts on the Central and South Coast. And one school district is going above and beyond. News Channel reporter Karen Cruz Adunia has more on that. Good job. I thought you were, you did great. How did it feel for you? Nervous. What were you nervous about? I don't know. Amelie Garayel is an 8th grade student at Vandenberg Middle School. She is an advocate for mental health. Mental health has been a thing that hasn't been talked about much for a very long time and it should be talked about since a lot of kids don't have what they, what they need to talk and express their feelings and that leads to a lot of issues at home at school. School counselors at the middle school have also seen an uptick in mental health services on campus. They have high academics as well and so you also see that in let's say if it's an honor student for example or even if they're not an honor student when they have lower mental health they're more likely to do worse in school. Lompoc Unified School District leaders took it upon themselves and applied for a program that raises awareness on mental health, cultural responsiveness, and equity. A total of 16 school districts across the nation were selected for the second round of the NCS3 Learning Collaborative Program. It's a two-year collaborative where uh, we, will we will receive support uh, from this national collaborative on uh, making sure that our schools are safe and supportive for all students in, in a variety of different ways. It provides Lompoc Unified with monthly virtual learning sessions, quarterly online training for staff, technical assistance, and training from national experts. That's looking at making sure that we're supporting our specific student groups within our, our schools. So whether that's uh, based on ethnicity, based on immigration status, based on LGBTQ um, status of students. Um, so understanding uh, the ways that we need to support specific individual students. Assistant Superintendent Brian Jaramillo says the first couple of schools that will benefit the most will be Vandenberg Middle School and Lompoc Valley Middle School. Students like Ayarel will have additional resources available as soon as this fall. I think it will be helpful since it will, it will add a new perspective on what we really have at the schools and it will just bring more people that haven't been able to speak up to really be able to speak up and get help for things that they need to. In the recent school board meeting, Lompoc Unified School District officials say students and parents expressed their priorities. One of them was mental health and with this new collaboration, it will help them out with this specific priority and it is set to launch in September. In Lompoc, I'm News Channel reporter Karen Cruz Orduña.